Okay, we'll start. We're going to do this one not by the dance, but instead by the silly sentence. Help me remember what this says. Do, do monkeys sniff brown rats? Do monkeys sniff brown rats? Not what Zach said. <laughs> do monkeys sniff buffalo rumps? And not what Kevin said. I won't even say what he said about beaver rears. <laughs> Instead, it's do monkey sniff brown rats. Okay, now D stands for what? Do divide. 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 M stands for? Multiply. S. Subtract. B. Bring down. Remain. Repeat or remain. All right, let's go through it. First three divides. Five. Does five go into one? No. So you go to 18. How many times does five go into 18? Three. Three times. Let's say I don't remember all my multiplication facts. I'm going to do my fives over here on the side real quick. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50. All right. So one, two, three. So it goes in three times. Next step is multiply. Five times three is 15. fifteen. Next step, subtract. Three, zero. Next step, bring down. Thirty-four. Repeat. You always work with the number you just created. So five goes into thirty-four. How many times? Six. Six times. I could check over here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Next one's too big, so it must be six. Five times six, now I multiply. Thirty. Then I subtract. And I bring down, but there's nothing else to bring down, so what's that tell me? Remainder. It's my remainder. You just solved it.